Certain breeds of dogs are easy to confuse. This is certainly the case with the Siberian Husky and Alaskan Malamute. While they are both recognized by the American Kennel Club and look like wolves, their personality and purpose are very different. Here we discuss the similarities and differences between the Malamute and the Siberian Husky. Malamutes and Huskies are often confused with each other, but if you see them stood side by side, there is no confusion. The Malamute dwarfs the Husky. A male Malamute stands at 25 inches tall and weighs between 85 and 100 pounds, sometimes even up to 140 pounds. Females are slightly shorter at 23 inches and typically weigh around 75 pounds. Malamutes are by far the larger dog as you should expect a male husky to stand at 22 inches tall and weigh around 50 pounds. Females should be a touch shorter at 20 inches tall and a bit lighter at around 40 pounds. Like the husky, Malamutes have a dense double coat. The outer coat, the guard coat, is short and coarse, whereas the undercoat is around two inches deep and is oily and woolly. This helps to wick away wetness and keeps them warm in the winter and cool in the summer. This is why double-coated dogs should never be shaved. They will shed this coat twice a year, spring and fall, so they aren't ideal if anyone in the household is allergic or if you like to keep your house immaculate and don't want dog hair on the floor. During heavy molting, you should brush them every day, and outside of molting, two brushes a week will help to keep their coat healthy. As for their eye color, unlike the Husky, which is known for their dazzling blue eyes, Malamutes have brown eyes. Whilst dark brown eyes are preferred for the breed standard, the shade of brown can vary to lighter shades of brown and orange eyes. If there is one thing to know about Huskies and Malamutes, it is that they are high energy. Because both of these breeds have high energy levels, they require lots of mental and physical stimulation. Without this, they can become destructive through digging, jumping, and chewing. Who chewed the headset? Who chewed the headset? Riley? Just like Malamutes, Huskies are friendly and playful and give affection to everyone they meet. If you're looking for a guard dog, neither the Siberian Husky or Alaskan Malamute is for you. The Siberian Husky is known for being more intelligent and cunning when compared to a Malamute. They are affectionately known as independent thinkers, meaning they will not be turned into an ultra-obedient dog. A Husky prefers to live with other dogs and will be loyal to their pack, whereas a Malamute will be loyal to their owner and enjoys spending time with humans. Both breeds have high prey drives and can't be kept with other types of small pets. One thing is for sure, they are demanding dogs and require a responsible owner who has the time needed to train and exercise them. Malamutes have a shorter lifespan and tend to have more health problems. On average, you should expect Alaskan Malamutes to live to around 11 years old. Siberian Huskies tend to live to be around 12 with the vast majority of them living between 10 to 14 years. Now you should know the difference between a Malamute and a Husky. They are both lovable fluffy giants, but each breed has their own unique traits, making them more or less suited to you depending on your requirements for a pet. Which breed do you prefer? Let us know in the comments section below.